Okay, now let me show you how we use our variables. So what I'm gonna do is go back over to our first resource we set up and copy the VPC. What I've also done is gone ahead and set up a provider so that we can use the AWS API and I've set the region to EU West 2. Again, this might be something you set as a variable on the off chance you need to change it at some point. But now let's go ahead and add something to this. We're going to set the name of the VPC. So to do that, we use tags equal to curly brackets and name equal to, and this is what we want to use as our variable. So let's start with strings. To use a string, we use bar dot and the name. So at the top, it's called VPC name. And save that. You may be wondering if you're coming from Terraform 0.11, maybe wondering why we didn't do this. This is called string interpolation. And what string interpolation does is it's a fancy term for replace the value inside. In this case, when we run Terraform plan, this will replace var.vpc name with the VPC name we set in our variable. In Terraform 0.12, string interpolation is no longer needed. So this is perfectly valid. And it's the same here for booleans and numbers, but it is different with lists and maps. So let's see those next. If you want to learn Terraform in depth with hands-on challenges and even get certified, make sure to go to warp-9.com.